to King's Quest. It's been a long journey. Now, what chapter is going to be? Chapter, wrong thing. Chapter 4. Only one more chapter to go after this one. Alright, let's get into it. Babies! Oh, I found the editing software. Um, PS4. <laughs> Pizza flavor jelly beans. What? I'm asleep. I'm asleep. I'm asleep. <sighs> so asleep. So asleep. So asleep. <sighs> Stay asleep, love. I'll check on the twins. And it's not your fault, not your fault, not your fault, not your fault, not your fault. I forgot anyway. But it's it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. You can watch, you can watch, you can watch, you can watch. Their palates can taste the difference, I'm told. Damn, you butt naked. Cloth diapers, every father's dream. I can just bump into anything. I should put that in a bottle first. Who ordered the clean sheets? Hey, this diaper is clean. Alright, if this gosh darn it, if his diaper is clean, what about this dude over here? Alright. I can do this. Are you sure you're not awake, Valenice? Oh now she is asleep. I got this. Oh, we had to go with the cloth diapers. <laughs> All clean. How's it feel, bud? <laughs> oh, really? That sounds like a bad idea. Uh, alright. Your call, your bluff. You're bluffing, aren't you? Not your style? Alright. Feel it? How does so it? precious when she sleeps. Hey. Oh, here it is. Alright. Our room is getting pretty crowded with all this baby stuff. God damn! How many baby bottles do you need? At least make it warm. Pretty cold. Oh yeah, put it over the fire. It could be warmer. Still so cold. It could Sweet be like warmer. Thirty seconds. Oh, smoke! Perfect. All right. Why did it turn yellow? Kind of weird. Down the hatch. There we go. Just right. All right. Time for a burping. Oh, smoke. <laughs> Dang. Of course. I can't wait till you're older, and we'll shoot our bows, and go on adventures, and we will all sleep through the night. Twins are great, they said. On barrel of laughs, they said. Well, they never tried putting twins to sleep. <laughs> I was about to say, is this... Gwendolyn and the other one? Okay, Prince. I have an idea. I don't think so. Dang. I may be king, but you are my prince. If life gets too puzzling, darn! I, I okay, I just can't. I may be king, but you are my prince. If life gets too puzzling, I'll give you the hints. 
Your quest has begun. My kingdom you'll run. I'll love you forever, my son. Oh no, I think it is. You are my arrow. I am your bow. Guiding your shot on the journeys we'll go. We'll make lots of puns. No puzzles undone. I'll love you forever, my son. So, Gwendolyn, I think. No, because they call Grandma and Grandpa. My map. So then, the I don't know. In my cap. And when my beard grows grayer and frail, you'll tell my tale. I bet he's gonna be a dentist. If you sleep sound <coughs> and try not to wake. Tomorrow I'll whip up a stack of pancakes. Bob. Chocolate chips by the ton. <laughs> we'll have so much fun. I'll love you forever, my son. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna start crying now. You better take care of me. I'm beautiful. Oi. Oh, smell. Do I have something in my tea? Why? Got a hot date? I might. I haven't asked her yet. Is this about Ooh. Royal Guard number three again? Don't bother. I asked her out this morning and she said I wasn't her type. Mm. Perhaps she's after a more muscular build. Like yourself? <laughs> Please. You look like a walking circus tent. Well, at least I don't dress like an upside down lolly. Your necklace is banal and trite. Your necklace is banal and trite. Well, you look like a trash can that swallowed a clown. I'd say you should be guarding a bridge, but that's offensive to the other trolls. Hm. I can hear every word, you know. I'm only six feet away. Zards, I thought she was royal guard number four. Still heard that. What? <laughs> They do know they're both dressed in the exact same getup, right? Last year's model. Not everyone can keep up with the latest fashion trends like us, Larry. Up top. Yeah. yeah. What the? Did you hear that? Hear what? Oh, smoke. Who is that? What the? Immediately. Is he the black guy? Or is he the guy who sounds black? God damn. Back away, intruder. This is your last <coughs> Ain't no way. Don't kill my my two men. Not them two. You can kill the other. You can kill those. Don't, just don't kill the, the the other ones in the back. No, come on, boys. That's far enough. Move aside, bucket heads. Sheathe your swords. Manny? Never. Not ever. Then take your move. Lock in. Brown, but I think he's Zoro. Four styles. <laughs> oh. Four styled. Four styled. Four styled. Larry. Manny. Come back and fight me, you coward. Larry. I'm top five saddest deaths in gaming history.
Raising these children will be our greatest adventure yet. I think they're gonna get stolen. I can't wait. Sweet I don't, never mind. Get the babies. Bam. Bam. I wouldn't make any sudden moves if I was you. Manny? Manny? No. Only my friends call me that. You can address me by my full name. Mananan. What happened to you? My mind outgrew my body. What do you want with me? Why is it always about nice you? Nice Stay away from them! Shh! You wouldn't want to wake them. Not when they're sleeping so soundly. Hey there, little guy. You look like you could use a friend. You're the spitting image of your father. We can't be having that. Do you hurt him? What do you want? I'll do anything. What I want is for your family to feel the pain you humans brought on me. To know what it's like to be raised in a world that rejected you. And your child, this baby, this, uh, what's his name? Prince. Alexander. Alexander! Oh, that just won't do. It's too regal and uninspired. How about Gwydion? Gwydion? Sounds more like a slave name, doesn't it? Huh? If you want the crown, take it. Turn, turn them back. Just leave our Blackford. babies alone. Don't fool yourself. I could snap my fingers right now and drop all of you dead. Dang! What fun would that be? It certainly wouldn't be very kingly of me. No. I want to earn that crown you stole from me, Graham, by proving that I'm better than you. And perhaps with a more thoughtful father, this child could help inspire change. No, you can't. Don't worry. We'll be back one day to claim his birthright. And after our little Gwydion inherits the throne, he will better serve the needs of Daventry. For all species. It won't work. I'll find you. Just try. No. They got burnt to Chris. No. no. Top five Saturday's deaths in history. We gathered a search party immediately. No one in Daventry would rest until Alexander was found. I thought you called him Prince. Or was that the Alexander! other one? Alexander! Birds, get the message out. The Prince has been kidnapped. Son! Can you hear my voice? I can't speak. Hello? Is anyone there? Just frogs. Fuck you. Have you seen the prince? Who are you talking to? Have you seen the prince? He's just hallucinating. Alexander! 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 Any sign? The no. first 24 hours are the most critical. We need to search everywhere. Contact everyone. The trolls, the Goblin King. Message V. Have her search in the east. Yes, absolutely. If she would respond to my letters. Right, what? No way. Oh, never mind. We'll work that out later. I won't sleep until Alexander is back in our arms. I'll reach out to Queen Madeline. Her squirrels can cover ground quickly. Good plan. We looked up every tree, down every goblin hole, hoping for a sign or clue from our son. I think I know where he is. Oh, I remember this place, I think, I believe. 
Isn't this the place with all those holes? Yep, it is. It's where we uh, found, what's his name? Triumph stuck on that tree. Yep. Oh, I might have to check the holes. Son, yeah. are you down there? Goblins, you better not have him down there for your sake. Probably oh, yeah. Man is a goblin, so I'm coming down there. No, you aren't. Oh, there, man, he is. I tore through that bedroom looking for any sign of my son. Hello? Then I found a small sliver of hope. I will never stop looking. And we didn't. For eighteen years, I never gave up hope. What? Eighteen years? It's time, dear. We've done all we can. Daventry needs you to get back to work. I'm not sure if I remember how. Come on, Dad. I'll help. Smash. Whoa, Who's that's alive? my daughter. A beautiful young lady. She was the perfect daughter. But it was hard for me to focus on anything knowing my family was incomplete. The Affordable Custard Initiative, really? That's the important paperwork crucial to Daventry's future? I'd rather be out searching for my son. Come now, dear. A spoonful of custard is the only joy some people get in this life. We have to break out of this funk. What about a vacation? The holiday's coming and... I've always wanted to visit the place where you met mom. We have to get through all this paperwork first. <laughs> no. Do you want me to whip up some choco chip pancakes? Oh, uh, that does sound good, actually. Perhaps for dinner. Oh, dinner. I know. Staring contest. <laughs> Those always cheer me up. Smash, oh. but I don't know. What's the matter? Afraid you might lose your undefeated record? Well, no, it's just... Too late. Tavern Tree Decree P33 P3 R5 states that no one can deny a starring contest when challenged by the royal family. <laughs> I knew that decree would backfire. Hmm. You're pretty brave challenging your father to a staring contest. Oh, is that a smirk? Nope. I just have a smirky mouth. Has anyone seen my keys? <gasps> staring contest! Oh, oh, oh. I see a smile. <laughs> this beard covers all smiles. You <laughs> will never win. I already blinked. Again. Have I ever told you? They call me Pockets, too. It's a family name. Is it blue? Oh, are you being heavy? Uh, no. Mm. No. Give me that. Kinda. That's gonna be hit. Okay, my eyes are really starting to hurt. Thinking on funny thoughts. Sardine smoothies. Frog dog Ugh. Fridays. Murphy's itchy back. Focus, Graham. You're slipping. Bro, what is this? I'm not concentrating. Tickle flight. Oh, 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 cheater. Cheaters, both of you. <laughs> <gasps> Alexander? Yeah. Huh? Actually, my name is Gwydion. What? Why did you just come in? It's like, my name is Gwydion. You're still in. Start to send you an N-word. Oh, 
wouldn't just write from the heart, dear. Uh, I'm just having trouble seeing the point of all this. And words are coming. Oh, I am. Um, since when have you had trouble finding words? Perhaps some popcorn flavored jelly beans would help spark your imagination? Sorry, love. But I just don't have much of an appetite, not even for popcorn flavored jelly beans. It was worth a shot. Come on, let's. Bust out of here! Wouldn't you rather be on, on an adventure? We could take that trip to Kaliba we've been talking about. That does sound lovely, but every moment with you is all the adventure I could ever hope for. It's best to take care of these things now. The doctors were pretty clear about that. It's time we tell the children. Mm. All right. You called for me? Yes. Your grandfather and I have something we would like to tell you. You should probably take a seat. Bro, this has been a movie. It's been... Oh, follow me. It's been like 30 uh, minutes and most uh, of this has uh, been a movie. Um, hold on. Let me gather my thoughts. You know... But I have had many great and fulfilling adventures. But there comes a time in every king's life when he must... When he must... There comes a time when every king must hand over his tasks to a worthy successor. And that's why I am giving you the very important job of filing this letter with the official court of amendments to addendums. I need some changes enacted immediately. Hmm. Was that all? Yes. The changes outlined in the letter are critical to the well-being of Daventry. Yeah, yeah, I got it. You should have told them that you're dying in five days. And which addendum should this be filed under? Why, the number is on the front, of course. Addendum 48677. Yeah. <clears throat> Farewell, Grandpa. Bye. Love you. Hope you feel better. Smash. What? Bro, let's get ransom. Yo, Gart, what's going on? Why haven't you been talking to me? What did I do? You like my butt. Whoa! Have a seat. Your grandma and I have something to tell you. Not even sure a story could cheer me up. What's the matter, sweetheart? It's Gart. He hasn't said one word to me for three days. He lost in our game of wits, but I don't think that's what's bothering him. He's just been so cold and distant lately. Me. I'm sure, whatever it don't, is. Don't, 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 don't. Of a strong family like ours are not easily broken. Actually, that does remind me of a story, one I have not thought about in a while. And interestingly enough... Go ahead. Interestingly enough, it's about your father. Who's our father? Is it Gideon? From Adventure? Yeah, no, Adventure Falls. Very Betty Falls? Winter. And Alexander was having a hard time adjusting to the life of a loyal. So we decided the best thing for everybody was to take a family vacation to Avalon. Avalon. Oh, the spot where you fell in love with Grandma. Yes, and the weather was much sunnier there this time of year. It would be a great opportunity to get to know my son. I had a thousand questions about how he escaped Mananan, but I didn't want to bombard him all at once. So, son. 
I thought perhaps we'd make a little detour so I could share one of my favorite spots. Sounds good to me. I do have one tiny request, though. Anything for my Alexander? Yeah. It's, um... It's that name. Uh, you don't want to call it anything, do you? Oh, no, no, no. It, it's just... I figured since I have to learn a new name anyway, why not pick something with a little more spark in it? You know, something with a little mystery? Something like... I don't know. Caduceus the Magnificent! Yeah, I, I always love that name. You don't um, seem like a do you actually caduceus. Want to be called caduceus? I mean, it's like a douche. It's a eh, eh, eh. More like a dream. Well, it's not a very princely name, but w we can talk about it. But really? Now, what to show you first? <gasps> oh! This place is very old. God Check it damn. out. The trophy that won me the knighthood. Very nice. Wait, is that a custard pie on the top of it? <laughs> Moving on. I'm gonna beat Manny up with this. This is my Wetzel Wolf patch. Sounds. When do I get a patch? Oh, you really are, my son. And this is a small sampling of my collected treasures over the years. The magic chest has provided our kingdom with many riches. The magic shield has protected Daventry for years. And these beautiful gems. Well, the gems were really just for bonus points. I like looking at them. They're pretty. They're pretty. They're, they're pretty. King Graham the Compassionate, huh? One day, you will have a statue of your own, right next to mine. Uh, I'm not sure that Alexander the Compassionate suits me. Well, who else will carry on the family legacy? Come on. King Caduceus has a nice ring to it. I'm does. Sharing a bit about my legacy with Alexander and showing him my treasures, we headed into town to grab some supplies for our trip. Oh, yeah. The tree. Forgot about this dang tree. Got to see the town tree. Mature right before my eyes. A luxury I wished I had with my son. Ah, right, let's see how she's holding my up. The shop was closed for the winter. Perhaps she went with Whisper on a snow retreat. Whisper? Oh, look at this place. Bit different, but all right. Let's talk about these dudes. <laughs> they haven't aged. Graham. Oh, it's been ages. Literally. Oh, and who's this handsome cinnamon roll? You never told me you had a brother. She aged. Wendy Bramble. This is Alexander, my son. The prince. He's returned? Oh, I can hardly contain my emotions. Welcome back to Daventry, your highness. But thanks. Oh, he wants to give you a hug. It's kind of his thing. Sorry, uh, I'm, I'm not familiar. Oh, well then, allow me to extend an invite to the purest form of love and compassion two friends can share. A handshake from the heart, if you will. It's easy. Just nuzzle over here and squeeze. I... I'm good. Thank you. You're a weird dude. Oh. Uh. Oh. Ah, uh. oh, man. <clears throat> I respect your boundaries and accept that while hugs... Me and my I don't see half joy, naked ladies. Not everyone needs to be hugged every day. Every Me hour, when I see big black men. I appreciate that. <laughs> I remember what the counselor said, Sugar Bum. Save that hug for tea. Mm, hugs have a shape. How is your little tack? Little? <laughs> He's a full grown man now. Moved to Serenia and started the garment business he did. Against his father's wishes, mind you. Bramble and I have no one to take over the bakery now. Oh, like you'd ever retire anyway. Even as a ripe raisin, you'll still be needing dough. <clears throat> That's exactly what I'm afraid of. Can you blame a dad for wanting his son to carry the torch? I no. certainly can't. All righty, boys. Here is the order for your trip. Go! Go! Uh, half your usual order? This body can't handle sweets the way it used to. Seriously, if I even look at a milkshake, my thighs will jiggle for a week. But Alexander, you are in for a real treat. No. 
What's your favorite pie, dearie? Let's make sure it's in the batch. Oh, yes. My favorite pie. <laughs> um, I like them all, really. It's so splendid, all the pies are. Oh, come now, Alexander. Everyone's got a favorite. I've got three. Where is um, it, Grandma? Uh, let's see. Uh, powdered powdered. fishbone pie. <laughs> is that one? <laughs> powdered fishbone pie. Is that even real? Don't tell me you don't know what a pie is either. Well, of course I know what a pie is. I've just never eaten one before. Manana never served sweets. No, no. Manana. <gasps> Monster. But uh, Stupid I, I wouldn't mind trying one. Let's not make this a big deal, Wendy. There you go, son. Try a slice of cheesy cherry pear. Mmm. Oh. Wow. That was actually pretty horrible. Miraculous, astonishing, divinely delectable. Was it cherry sweet? Do we make a great pear? Or did your pies deceive you? Too cheesy or gouda enough? Was it a winner, or should we bury it? Okay, I you could stop. hope you love it as much as we do. <laughs> yes, to all of those things. Quite tasty. Here, take another slice. I'd recommend enjoying this one with a mug of our hot chocolate butter. Uh, there's a thermos full of it out front. Well, thank you. It, it was very nice meeting you both. They gotta be at least 120 years old. Cause at least I'm like 60 or so. Just hide that on your cape, like do the little. <sighs> yeah. Your you just have to bramble. Can I offer you some free advice? Always. Treasure that boy. Thank the shining stars every day that he's back. Need him with unconditional love. Mix in some encouragement and support. And when it comes time for him to rise, give him the space to grow. Thank you, Bramble. That was a gift. We, um, actually have another gift for you. A surprise we've been saving for a while. Oh? <clears throat> Your Highness, we wanted to tell you that you've done such a great job as a compassionate leader. And you have turned this kingdom around for the better. Love mm -hmm. can be felt in every inch of Daventry. And it's all thanks to King Graham the Compassionate. And to celebrate all your accomplishments, we wanted you to have this. Your grandmother's secret starshroom pie recipe? What? No one outside our family knows that recipe. A fact that will remain true now that you have it. I will hang this amongst my most precious treasures. You keep doing you, kid. Now get along. I wouldn't want to keep your boy out in the cold. Goodbye, Bramble and Wenty. Thanks for all the guidance. Literally. Maybe y'all are the most wonderful people I've... Or out of everyone in the game. Smash. On Alexander. So, what? how are we getting to this Avalon? Is there like a parade of royal steeds? Are they late? <laughs> I wanted the whole family to ride together, so I booked the most spacious carriage I could think of. Konnichiwa, riches! Boy, so good! How's he a lot? Bold! I mean, bold! <laughs> Holy Stromboli! You've multiplied, mated, and procreated! Ha, doink, doink! And you let your belly day slide! I never got married. Research shows it's the number one cause of divorce. But uh, oh, just look at all those beautiful cheeks to pinch. Well, Chug that's how you get married. Whoosh, salami, whoosh, saliva. Whoosh. Oh, if I met this one, I'd never forget a face like that. Call me Caduceus. Oh yeah, you're that Gwydian guy. Your dad rescued me from the goblins. Pity he couldn't save you. Now then, that's enough dawdling, people. Let's get this freak show on the road. Grab Damn. You to load your own luggage. Mr. Fancy Cakes is peeved you left him to die in the caves. And I forgot to pack my oh. lifting shorts. All right. I got this. Do you want help? No, dear. I got this. I'm not sure that will all fit. Should we tie some to the roof? It'll fit. I'll make it fit. Wait. I forgot. You don't need one. This is tight. 
We can uh, go back inside. Who is this? That's a ghost. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Shut up. I didn't even there think of that. All aboard Team Sovereign. Please stop trying to make that a thing. You're not even pronouncing it right. I kind of like it. Atta boy, Caduceus. Bless you. All right, unicorns, let's boogie. Our trip was off to a great start. The heat of the sun would be nice. But nothing warmed my soul more than seeing our whole family together. Making new memories and loving on each other. Ah, it smells like rare and miraculous ingredients back here. Is that you, Alexander? It's probably that goat creature with the one eye. I wouldn't speak about Mr. Fancy Cakes like that. Isn't this nice? All of us together, going on our first adventure. Alexander, scoot over. I'm scooted over as far as I can go. Anybody have any good puns to share? Can we stop up ahead for a picnic break? We just stopped for a picnic break. Your point being... Are we almost there? Come on, Team Sovereign. Why don't we play a game? I always used to play this with my sisters on long road trips to pass the time. I do love this game. I'll start. Let's see how far we can get. My record is seven rounds. Just repeat what the person before you said, and then add your very own flavor to the list. I'm going on an adventure, and I'll bring... A crumbler. portable crumbler. Well, I hear Amaya is working on one anyways. <clears throat> I'm going on an adventure, and I'm bringing a portable crumbler, and adding to that, a cat cookie. What is a cat cookie? Just a little concoction of mine. With one bite, it'll turn you into a cat. That's how I escaped Mananan. You turned Mananan into a cat? You never told me that. Well, you never asked. I asked, how do you escape? I'm going to bring a portable crumbler, a cat cookie, and a purple pumpkin lantern to light the way. Hmm. I'm going to bring a portable crumbler, a cat cookie, a purple pumpkin lantern, and my mail cart, my harpsichord, and my didgeridoo. Oh, sorry, can that count as one? I'm going on an adventure, and I'm bringing... A tent? Ah, <laughs> uh, I forgot. I guess I'm out. What? After I lost, I convinced the family to try another round, secretly hoping to beat my record. I think we can get further than that. Let's try again. I'm going on an adventure, and I'm bringing... A portable crumbler, I'm going on an adventure, and I'll bring a portable crumbler, and... Excellent work, everybody. I beat my record. Yeah, that road trip where we are. Here we are, kids. Wondrous Avalon. And look at what? Was this like off season? The weather is usually so nice this time of year. Aww, I hope the squirrels aren't hibernating. Oh, these clouds will probably pass. Let's head to the resort. I'm sure they'll have trees to climb. Hey, y you guys forgot. Uh, never mind. I'll get it. Mmm. Did you just pick it up? I knew it. Put in your ding dang cape. Oh, it's because of the oh. As a result oh. of the new management. Well, it did need a facelift. <laughs> Those inverted water slides were a huge liability. Uh, are you sure we're in the right place? Yeah, I don't have a good feeling about this. Oh, come on, kids, it's an adventure. I'll check us in. It's because of the tower. Checking in for the Graham family. We should have the royal suite. She's frozen. It's me, 
Thanks, kindly. Is that our room up there with the balcony? Oh, how rude of me. Here you go. Yep, she totally remembers me. You want know royalty out here? You're all to one region. Right this way. Can't believe this place got all ruined because some ding ding. I hope the beds here aren't made of piles of itchy straw and rusty nails. <laughs> no, of course not. Only the best for my boy. Should we ask the guard for directions? Oh, honey, please. I know where we're going. This place got ruined. A whole world's we got probably. separate rooms. I don't know if I can handle your snoring. Oh, please. If I snored, I would hear it. <laughs> I feel... Yeah, since the ice kept spreading and spreading, I got locked. Because it doesn't love itself. No, that's what you did. No, that's what you did. Let's go close. I knew it. <gasps> what just happened? Oh. It's a trap. I knew it. Oh. Trapped. Not oh. possible. Don't you get it? Oh. This must be one of those new mystery themed resorts. Oh, how exciting. I believe they called this an escape room. I've always wanted to try one. Everyone, search for clues. Alright. What the freak is this? What the hell is going on? Oh. Don't interrupt a lady in clue searching mode. Okay. I hope if I play the right tune, a leprechaun will appear. Hmm. Well, that can't be right. Let me try again. This is a clue, right? I really shouldn't hmm. be messing with that lock until I have all the clues. Wrong combination could be a penalty. Ooh, nice painting. Ooh, don't know what the freak that is. Ooh, paper. I read a ah! switch, but my puzzling instincts knew better. It was a textbook case of reverse psychology, a trap for certain. Oh hey, if the sign says pull the switch, don't mind if I do. Oh, he falls and dies. Accelerator activated. Your time to escape has now been cut in half. Um, everyone's cool with challenge mode, right? Seven, six, come on, we can do this. Three, two. <laughs> do puzzles usually try to kill you? Oh, it's all part of the fun. Impressive design. Wherever you are. Ooh. No need to yell, gentlemen. These puzzles are meant to exercise your brain, not your lungs. <laughs> ding ding. What is that thing? Apologies. I did what not the? start from you, Mr. Mr. Alexander. Is that right? Yeah, or Caduceus. You know, your choice. What shall we call you? Me. People call me many things, Mr. Majesty, but a simple sphinx will do. Sphinx? Now, let me be the first to welcome you to the Ice Palace. I will be your host for this evening's festivities. Oh, thank goodness. Are you responsible for the amenities here? We were supposed to be given souvenir rubber duckies on check-in, and I don't want to make this a big deal, but no ducks were given. I'll have some waiting with your wife and daughter. Do you know where they went? This is supposed to be an adventure for the whole family, and I can't really relax unless everyone is together. Oh, the other half of your family has been escorted to the top of that tall, twisty fortress? They oh. will remain there safely until you... Correction? If you reach the center of the map. If? Oh, there, there must be some mistake. I... I booked the summer sizzling savings package for four, I believe. Of course, Mr. Majesty, I'll let the front desk know right away until I can straighten that out. 
Might I suggest continuing toward the center? There are some glorious puzzles up ahead. Well, I guess one or two couldn't hurt. Sound good, Alexander? Do I have a choice? Right this way, Probably gentlemen. Not. Step lively. This puzzle is a bit tricky, but I know you two can do it. All right, son. This should be fun. Now, you should know that I believe in the four E's of puzzle solving. Experimenting, educated guessing, execution, and enlightenment. Can we just throw some things at the wall and, I don't know, see what sticks? Oh, no, 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 no. Alexander, our family does not take part in trial and error. Yes, they freaking do. Watch and learn. Just try this one time, I guess. Like a puzzle? Sam. Get out of here. Where's the labyrinth gave out trophies? What is it with your generation and always wanting rewards? You don't need a reward for everything you do. Incredible. You solved the easiest puzzle. Line stripper. Uh, I mean, I mean stripper. So, I mean, stepper. <laughs> Strip. Do you want this one? I am perfectly happy learning from the best. I don't want to hog all the fun. He but looks gay. Probably be gay. Probably just on him. Alright, this one seems easy. I'ma end it off here. Just because I'm kinda out of time. It's about to be like an hour or so. Uh, yeah. Oh! Editing software. I can edit really good now.